now we're going to be looking at some document management within the 3D Experience platform. Documents are managed in much the same way as, as the CAD is. They also have their own placeholders and own maturity as objects in the platform. In this case, we're going to be looking at something called the Bookmark Editor, which is much the same as Windows Explorer in Windows, File Explorer in Windows, and bookmarks are essentially folders. So it's another method of organizing your documents. As you can see here, I've got a bookmark under important documents and I've got some documents listed here with various information specific to each document. You can also use it to store CAD. So you can store CAD specific to a project or a product. It's just another way of essentially creating links between your products and or documents. For documents specifically, you can upload anything from Windows Explorer. You can also drag and drop it to upload it into the onto the platform or into a specific bookmark. In this case, I can also, because this is a Word document, I cannot edit it on the platform, but a reservation capability is possible with checking out for, it, for edition. So I can select the document, check out to download it, edit it, and then check it back in once the edition is complete. And all of this is traced. So it's all traceable. There's a, a history of this document, which will indicate when it was last modified, for example, or how many times it's been modified. In addition to that, we can have a look at the maturity or life cycle state of a document in the same way that you can with CAD. So that goes for whether it's in work, frozen and about to be released or released. And the same thing applies for looking at different revisions. So here you can see the revision, the first revision is in the release state and the next revision is in the in work state. And this provides the full traceability of all your documents. You can also view documents in a different way, which is similar to using the filter from the search. So in document management, I can view all documents within the database. I can view my own documents. Finally, we can associate documents directly with CAD. So in this case, I'm looking at the product structure explore. And I'm looking at this assembly. So if I go specific to this assembly and I want to attach a document, it can be done through the properties on the right hand side here. So I've gone to attachments and there you can see the specification document already associated with this assembly.